Okay, so I know I haven't made a video in a little bit. I apologize about that. I've been working a lot. A lot of stuff has been happening. School, life. Hi, Caesar. <laughs> Say hello. Hi. Hi. But here I am, and <laughs> let's get back to the videos. Currently, I am about to rake the barn. Uh, there's lots of leaves and stuff in here because it is now fall, as you can tell by these beautiful trees behind me. Oh, so bright. And yeah, the barn's just looking a mess, so I'm gonna sweep and rake and pick up manure, and then I'll get back to you. So all done cleaning the barn. Now we're just about to brush Chaco because he just got ridden, and the lady who rode him for her lesson had to run off. So we're just going to brush them and turn them out. Then we went into the field to take off blankets. And since that's done, now I'm about to sack up Loxley and ride. He hasn't been ridden since I rode him on Tuesday. So it's currently Sunday, which means he is going to be very up to say the least. So we'll see how this goes. While I was schooling Loxley, Mary decided to ride Nugget and school him along with me. Turns out both of the horses weren't actually feeling very fresh that day and they were pretty good um, listeners. We had an overall good ride and Loxley was even a little lazy. I did have to push him a little off the ground, but overall I'd say both of them were really good and it was a pretty positive ride. Good ride on Loxley. It got pretty hot, so I actually had to take off my sweatshirt. Just kidding, it's freezing again. Um, but Nugget was really good. <laughs> and Loxley was really good. And Caesar got in the way. So now our next task is to get out Bunny and Louie. And Louie, if y'all have been watching my videos for a while, know that he was started and then left in a field for a while and we restarted him but then he lost all his shoes because of the mud and the rain and the cold and he's been sitting out in the field for a while so now we just have to re-restart him uh, so that's going to be fun we'll see if he's wild we might need to lunge him before we get on we might not even get on it all depends um so here we go you will never believe how dirty Louis' bridle is. He hasn't been ridden in a long time because of his shoes. And look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Oh. Oh my God. I used vinegar to clean both his bridle and the saddle just so it would get rid of the mold that was on there and it wouldn't be harmful to the horses at the same time while killing the mold. I was going to use ammonia, but 
Even though it does a good job, it is pretty toxic smelling. I also wipe down his saddle with the vinegar just for good measure. So here's baby, maybe not so baby Louie. He was very good and stood still while we tacked up. Only this one little scare at absolutely nothing as per usual. And he walked down to the arena quite nicely, even ignoring Caesar, who was running around its feet and being obnoxious. We chased him around the ring for a little bit, and it was so funny, he chose to go over these jumps. It really shows how much he remembered, since he's taking the correct lead most of the time after he jumps them. And he was really good when we actually did get on his back, but I didn't get any film of that, so sorry. Louis really surprised us today. He was very good. Um, he really calmed down after we lunged him and chased him around. I've just put Loxley's blanket back on after he's eaten some grass, and now I'm just going to chuck him out into the field. All right. That was a very good day at the barn. It was beautiful weather. It was hot, cold, hot, cold, but that's okay. Much better than the rain and the freezing that we've been having. Um, and so here's where I'm going to end my video today. Um, thank you so much for watching, you guys. If you liked this video, please like, comment, and subscribe down below to see more content like this. Until next time, bye.